has officially begun. About 14 minutes late, but that's okay. That's not that bad of a delay. Hello, everybody. I am Iron Guts. This is the Glee Club want to introduce themselves. Hello, this is Basket. Chirp, Quaddle here. I'm a dog. Okay, then. <laughs> So, it's been a little while since we've done one of these, so I'm a little rusty on setting it up, but hey, we got what we got. So, first up, we it's been so long and people wanted it, so we're going to do some medium matchup. For those of you who have never played this before, it's a pretty fun and simple game uh, that requires a lot of prep time for, for me. Not for anyone else, though. Uh, the name of the game is that there are two titles to a piece of media, whether it's a movie video game or television show that share a common sound or word you put them together and then you describe that thing the mashed up movie or mashed up pieces of media and people need to guess what the title is so for example the example one that i always give is uh what where is it again the dynamic duo has to steal from the corrupt and greedy rich and from that you could guess Batman and Robin Hood, which is a combination of Batman and Robin and Robin Hood. Does that make sense how that works? Yeah, I guess a bit. What do you, what? <laughs> I might just watch this one. This is outside of my realm of expertise. Robin Hood, and then, uh, I don't know where you got Batman. What? Where did you get Batman The dynamic from? duo, Batman and Robin. Um. Oh, okay. Never mind. So you kind of you kind of get now where it comes from, right? <laughs> okay, yeah. that's good. Because I have got a whole bunch of these that I've done in the past, and uh, maybe a few new ones. But uh, well, I'm probably gonna be bad at it unless it's like really popular stuff. Well, you try to use really really popular ones. So to start off with, this is gonna be the oh god, it's gonna copy and paste in the small size. Oh, well, I can zoom in like this, and then we should be able to see it, hopefully. If I zoom in 200%, there we go. Nope. Okay. The stream. And there, for, for the people with the stream lag, I post it in the chat room as well. The first media magic of the night. A man and his faithful robot... What? Right. Okay, A man? Because I have got a whole bunch of these that I've done uh. in the past... Turn! Oh god, I can hear my voice on a delay of like 20 seconds. A man and his faithful robot companion travel through time, and while in the past, they must ensure his parents get together. Also, the man is his own grandfather. This is two, two things put together. It can be more than two occasionally. Hmm. I know one of them. I don't know what the. S Anyone gonna help talk it out? <laughs> uh, I know what one of them is. I just don't. Well, know which the which do you part. have? The first or the second? Well, I have the first. I think I have the first. You think part. so? I think so, because I can't imagine, you know, anything that has, you know, the first part of what I think is the first part. I have no as idea. the last part. I'll probably well, so, like, oh. In general, I try to keep these in order so that the first piece of media is the first part of the sentence. Uh, in this case, it's actually reversed. Well, sort of. Uh, Man and his faithful robot yes. companion. What could that be? There's so uh, many let me, let me, things Let me change the word. Were... A man and his drunkard robot companion travel through time, and well, in the past, they must ensure his parents get together. The man's his own grandfather, by the way. Yeah, I 
I have, I have no, no idea. idea. I only know the second part. Or technically one the is first from part. TV. The other one is a very famous movie. <laughs> very movie. Famous what? One of my, one of my uh, one of my TV. personal favorite movies of all time. I don't. I, I hardly watch TV, but I'll probably be like, "Oh, when I hear the answer." Probably. Uh, <laughs> does cop have something to nope. do with it? This is this does not involve time cop. <laughs> no, I was oh, not okay. thinking time cop. I don't know what the first one is. The second one should be obvious. Like, come on. If you know the plot of the movie, of it's course. obvious, but... Uh. I say we do Furry Jeopardy as well. Furry Jeopardy? <laughs> I... Yeah. Where could I play that? I would like to play that. I know, you right? It. It just spend a bit of time and create a Furry Jeopardy. Alright, I, I think do I'll do that time. for the next game night, then. That is a great idea. <laughs> And, All right, um, I yeah. <laughs> the question has has prop hunt ever been a thing? Indeed, yeah, the thing but, that uh, sucks is that not everyone has Gmod. Damn it! Exactly. I yeah, want I it. want to play those on here, but not everyone has TF2 or Gmod. Ew. Why not? Why not run a TF2 one? Prop I hunt is TF2 it. as well. well and TF2 yeah, TF2 is, free. is yes, it is. It is? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I think TF2, not everyone can run it on their computers. I can run it, it just lags a bit. It Here, runs man. on the same engine as Gmod should, well, so they yeah. can run at the same quality. Yeah. Anyways. I, I wish mean, I even potatoes could run. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, 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 no. That is where you're wrong. I used to have a potato, and it was freezing like hell. A man wow. and his a man and his drunkard fair? robot companion travel through time. While in the past, they must ensure his parents get back together. The man is also his own grandfather, no. frozen for a thousand years. <sighs> frozen for a thousand years. This. Uh. You got it. <laughs> I have no clue. Yeah, I got nothing. No. Nope. China wants to Doc Terminator who? <laughs> no. uh, I'm sorry, Croc. Is... I'm sorry, Croc. That's incorrect. <laughs> that is that is a good one, though. I love that portmanteau. That is a great that, portmanteau. That is, except that it doesn't fit within the rules oh, of the look... game. Because it Doc Terminator... With who at the end that's inserting a title into the middle of another one. This is where you have one title and then the other and their ends match up. So you basically, like, you have to combine the yep. titles together, right? Yeah. So I, have, like, uh... I actually have a good one in the chamber. Like, if you guys let me make one, I have a good one. Well, we'll uh, do that. But I don't know this one. Are, are we uh, officially no. giving up on this one then? Uh, I give up. China, China China's got it, so it. why don't you post it, China? Back to the Futurama. Oh, no wonder I didn't know it. I don't watch da Futurama. <laughs> oh my god, I hate you. Shit. Futurama? Yes. A man and his drunk robot companion oh, travel god. around through time. They do that in a couple of episodes. Ah. I yeah, <laughs> see, now I get it, too, because yeah. Bender. God damn it. was the microwave yes. episode. Yes! This is what I love about this game. Oh. You hate yourself for not knowing the answer. <laughs> I do hate myself. But no, I Shina, you. I knew Back to the Future. I knew Back to the Future, Shina. I just I didn't both. know Futurama. I knew both. I hate you. I hate you. I hate myself. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do another. Uh, the thing is, oh, that was one of the ones I considered an easy one. <laughs> oh, crap. Oh, I'm not ready for this. Well, here. Well, readier, ready or not, here comes the next one. The evil plan to steal all the fresh air from the planet hinges on this legendary ping pong tournament. <laughs> uh. Gaming. 
<laughs> Don't you have your own? I, uh, is it, I'm assuming it's TV This, and movies, this is two right? movies. Ah, crap. Evil plan to steal all the fresh air from the planet me. hinges on this legendary ping pong what? tournament. Alright. Cool. Uh, oh. I have a guess. Oh. Space balls of steel? You're not. What was it? You're close. It is not space balls of steel. That could have been a good one, though. Well, the thing is, he's. I think he's thinking of the right movie, but he's misremembering the title. It's Space Balls of Fury. I don't remember the... Oh, Balls of Steel is probably a different movie or something. <laughs> I haven't seen the Ping Pong <laughs> movie, okay? I knew Space Balls because it, it worked, but... Uh... Lorax? I think that's one of them. I mean, Evil <clears throat> plan to steal all the fresh air? Yeah, that was the Space Balls plan. What is that? Yeah. Yeah, I knew space balls. <laughs> I just my brain was like, "Hey, this is familiar." <laughs> That's how the game works. All right, next one. In Australia, the poacher must be stopped from capturing an endangered animal, the wolf, whose race happens to be fighting a war against oh, vampires. God. Oh god. This is uh, I I think I know the second one. I don't know the first one. Well, this 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 one's a bit furry. Uh -huh. The first the first half of what this is one is furry. Thing? The other half of this is totally not furry. Uh -huh. Um. In Australia, the poacher must be stopped from capturing an endangered animal. Oh. I'm lost. I know the second one. I don't know the first one. As usual. I, I'm surprised, because I think it would be the other way around. I'll give you guys a clue. The, the first well, one... I, mean, I know I know the werewolf versus vampires one. I think. You think? Uh, well, the first, one, the first one is an animated kids movie. Uh, oh, if it's animated, then I guess I don't know what it is. Animated movie and kids mm -hmm. movie. And I'll give another mm. big, big, big hint. Mm. Not by Disney. Not or by is Disney, it? So it's probably no, a Pixar it's, movie then. Actually, it's, Pixar. or is oh, it Disney? Wait, wow. I can't quite remember at the moment. <laughs> no, I don't what should be Disney title? Pixar? Well, no, it's not. It's it's before Pixar. It's an it's before 2000s. Oh, that's okay, way too so early then. I'm, I'm not that old. Probably gonna be wrong, but Absolutely. can I guess? Yeah. Um. Rescuers down. That underworld. is correct. No, it's not called Underworld, is it? <laughs> yeah, that was. Oh. Yeah, I was the Rescuers underworld. Down Underworld. The rescuers down under, where the rescuers travel to Australia and have to stop that poacher with the awesome lizard uh, from getting the bald eagle. So wait, what is rescuers uh, movie from? Like, is it I I Pixar think it's or? a Don Bluth movie. <laughs> At least I'm pretty sure it is. Someone Google it. Writers, director. Hey, you guys want a cringy movie that's furry? Watch oh, Romeo. God. Produced by Walt Disney Feature Animation and reduced by, uh, released by Walt Disney Pictures on November 16th, Okay, so it is Disney. The 29th oh, yeah, Disney no wonder I didn't know him. What? It is it indeed Disney. Disney. Yeah. I've never heard of it. Really? Either, I usually watch it's one of my movies. favorite childhood movies. Yeah. It is so wonderful. It was a little and obscure, I though, watched in the time. The movies. I've watched the old ones, too. Hmm. Well, I mean, I've seen a VHS of it somewhere. I've just never actually seen the VHS of it. I'm surprised Disney kept up the uh, racist ones as well. The racist well, TV. it's part of their history, you know? Like, all of their videos were racist yep. at some point. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, let's go for another one, shall we? Yes. 
You yes. shall oh be trapped God. forever yeah. in the game of media mashup. Aquatic predators from Saturday morning fake being beaten by a lesser animal on the food chain because they don't want to kill for their food. Okay. This is two things, both animated. Uh, both animated. So it's a Saturday morning cartoon and something uh -huh. else. Second yes. one, a movie? Saturday morning cartoon and mm -hmm. movie. Oh god, Rip, I never had a childhood. <laughs> no! And yet somehow you became a furry. I'm not sure how that works. Most furries, like, came from having that Saturday morning childhood. Or... <sighs> I know all Saturday these, but I can't guess the titles off the top of my head. <laughs> That's what makes the game a challenge. Wait, I I don't know why I think this, but I think yeah. I might have a guess. Kenny the Shark Tale? No, but that works well too. Shina just got it though. Street Shark's Tale. Never heard of that. Oh god, Street Sharks! Street Sharks! They're awesome! I've actually never, never heard, heard of Street Sharks. I just barely caught the tail end of that as a kid. I, like, had just missed it, and it's a shame, because that was fucking awesome. Uh, never my question it. is, where did that air? Oh, God, I have no idea. <laughs> How about Animorph? But Kenny, Kenny the Shark oh, Tale works very nicely as well. I hadn't thought about that. <laughs> I've actually never heard of Street Sharks. What's it about? was basically right after the Teenage Mutant Turtles got big, and they were trying to replicate the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Like, in the most blatant way. It was uh. giant buff anthropomorphic sharks. It was I wish you could play a little video on the stream with it for, like, a second. To be fair, I'm going to have to refresh the stream soon, because I have the... I have offline across my screen as I'm seeing uh, what's actually going on. It's well, I can pull up images right here. Street Sharks. Oh, that looks... <laughs> bad. It was bad, yeah, it but look it was also bad. so good. It's a so bad, it's good Absolutely. situation, huh? You wanted to kiss <laughs> Nobody oh like my god, he hot. so fucking okay. was. Hang on a second. Okay, oh dear. Oh boy, Here we go. I'm gonna go look it up myself right now. Moby Lick was the orca uh, of the group, and damn, he looks thick. Oh boy. Oh, bit of fed. Oh god, it does look like a ripoff version, though. Yes, total ripoff of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Dude. <laughs> That red one. What's the red, red what? one? Red and oh. white shark. Uh, hang on, let me go ahead again here. Well, he was the whale shark. Uh, let me think here. Can I see? Can I see what one he actually was? Big Slamu. Oh God. Big Slamu, the whale shark. Oh, the names. Are I just know they are. What is the uh, <laughs> one you guys? Moby Lick, yes. the orca. <laughs> they couldn't have at least made them like close to what they what the names are referencing. Uh, you can't ops though, like woo. you can't oh, make God. a character named Moby Lick and not have it be, you know. Oh, and they were and they were all into mm -hmm. action sports too, like skateboarding, skate uh, rollerblading, you know. <laughs> <laughs> of course they were. It was the most late 80s, early 90s thing in the universe. So good. Uh, they were edgy. Yes. Maximum edge. Oh, and they and they crossed over you once in a while with the extreme dinosaurs. <laughs> which was another <laughs> which was another ripoff of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. That was equally as unsuccessful. <laughs> and yet you can find furry art of it all over the place. <laughs> Which is? Because uh, wasn't there a lot of like fetish well, content that was kind of just yep. slipped in? Well, I yeah. don't feel like there's porn or street starts now. <laughs> what? Is there? 
there not real like, street cars? Oh, there's plenty of it. Yes. <laughs> plenty of it. I'm not, I'm not, no. I'm not, no, I'm not no, going no, to on the stream because I want to be able to put this up on YouTube. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's not something. Come on. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> So, back to media mashup, but that's something to look up after the stream. Oh, God, no. <laughs> Here we go. Here's here's a really f one of my favorite mashups. And post. This spy has to travel back through time to protect a woman on the run from her ex-boyfriend. He just happens to have disassociative identity disorder. I've got nothing on that one. Straight up nothing. <laughs> Why do I feel like the second one's a comedy? They're both Same. comedies. Oh. Hmm. They're both comedies starring big name comedians. I don't watch I comedy. Don't no. Mm, I'm lost here. I prefer uh, actions. Yeah, I think all of us are striking a blank on this one. Really? You give it up so easily? Does anyone have a guess? Nope. On either of them. This. <laughs> Once I got used to this game more, I'm probably going to be guessing right What's away. What's a comedy spy movie where the spy travels through time? <gasps> yeah! <laughs> <laughs> ah. And then what's the only comedy you'd think you know of with a guy who has dissociative identity multiple personality disorder slash dissociative identity disorder? I don't think I've ever seen a comedy that has a character who has multiple personality disorder. Well, you might not have seen it, but you probably have heard of it. You can answer, Shina. Everyone else seems to be, like, totally ready to give up. Shina's the only one getting scores here. I've got nothing. I'm still Hello? here. Uh, yeah, it on. seems like somebody's It seems connection. so. It's not me. Uh, Lyrics, can you say something? I'm here. I'm okay, here. so it must be... Huh. Weird. Mm. Weird. Because okay. I heard... What's the answer? Adding. I want to know the answer. Yeah, China, just say China, it. take the guess. China, your last hope. No, it is not Austin Powers, the International Man of Mystery Man, Ooh. but that's another mashup off my list. <laughs> The A correct answer, <clears throat> Austin Powers, the spy who shagged me, myself, and Irene. Oh, good lord. <laughs> wow, that was a long Well, one. just because Austin Powers, me, the spy who shagged me, is a long title. I was actually well, I thinking something about Austin Powers. I just didn't know. I don't <laughs> know the Austin Powers like line of movies. I th I, I watched yeah, them at a formative yeah. time in my teenagerdom, so they're forever embedded in my memory. Of course. But Austin, I love what happened with this title because it sounds like another Austin Powers sequel. Austin Powers inspired Shag Me, myself, and Irene. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Uh, yeah. All right, can I go? Sure, go right I ahead. I have a good one. Okay, so I'm going to post okay. it in the chat. Okay. In this not-so-popular ruination of a wonderful series, you'll break down from stress if you don't play with your wallet. Best to keep the torch high and slap your minions. <laughs> These are both games, oh, because okay. I am a gamer. So, hmm. Hmm. Slap your minions? What is that a... Huh. Are these I... games popular at all? They were both popular. Okay, so it's yes. two. At what time? Hmm. 
Because that one, one, one was not popular, but it was infamous, Yeah, I think like. I know which one it is. Uh, slap your Here's mind. a hint. The first game... The first game has the best narrator of any game I I've have ever no heard. idea because I've never yeah, played I've never it. Played so game. I do not know. Yeah, I've never played any narrator. Oh, yeah. I don't know that I've played a game that has narrators, so exactly. I don't know. None of you have played the Stanley Parable? No, oh, no. I've seen the Stanley Parable played. That, <laughs> that game is a mindfuck for the people. Best the best game. game. You're going to like sit down in the chair making me play. <laughs> That's something to look up and buy and play because, my God, it's amazing. Ugh. I what could be the second one? Keep your torch high and slap your minions. What? What could that possibly be? Huh? Yeah. I, no, it is not. That's just what a I was game. thinking, but no, it couldn't be. Keep your torch high and slap your minions. Why did you remind me of people? What did ever no googling. <clears throat> Do you guys give I up? Don't. Oh, oh yeah, I'm still going. I it. I'm thinking, but I don't know what else. I don't know a popular thing that starts with that. Although it did just give me an awesome freaking idea for a new mashup. Uh, all right, uh, you guys have like a minute left. Unless you just want to concede now. I, I'm going to concede. Because I can't think of anything else other than the mashup that I just caught up, came up with. <laughs> Alright, so... Shina wants to try. Okay, Shina gives up. So, Let me... the game is Darkest, Darkest Dungeon Keeper. Darkest Dungeon Keeper? Okay. Darkest Dungeon is a hellishly difficult roguelike that is quite popular that features light and stress as integral mechanics. All right. Dungeon Keeper was a popular series that got ruined by a mobile port because the developer because the publisher greed. It was a, you know, dungeon management game that turned into a microtransaction laden, you know, one of those games. Okay then. I you had never heard of, heard of I had really? I had never heard of Darkest Dungeon. I knew about Dungeon Keeper somewhat, but I was stuck on Mighty Number no. Nine. I was thinking, it, what? Cause think about it, not so popular ruination of a wonderful series. That's Mighty Number no. Nine right there, and, and they ripped off so many people. So you play with your wallet made sense. So I was like, but what torch game could go? And I was thinking like Mighty Number no. Nine Rim for Skyrim, but that doesn't work. So, <laughs> ouch. I'm sorry oh, for doing yes. something that I honestly thought the two, you know, the two series were very, you know, well perhaps. known. Hey, Darkest I, Dungeon is perhaps hard they to are, tell. but among a different crowd. Hey, I you might want to look up both of them if you don't get it. I love how you wrote your uh, dungeon. Right? That's all right. I had caps. Yeah, apparently, yeah, apparently, apparently I have caps. caps on. Oh well, I don't give a crap. <laughs> Me don't give a crap. <laughs> Me have me have another <laughs> challenge for you. When a okay. when a baby no. is born, when a wolf and a purr, an abomination, the abomination with no tails and two heads, has to stop the end of existence from happening. When God is lost after a trip to play skee ball in New Jersey. Oh dear. I love how well well this one fits together. When. Baby is born with a wolf and a purr. Right. The abomination with no tails and two heads has to stop the end of existence from happening when a god is lost after a trip to... Wow, that's awful. <laughs> yep. I oh. have a guess for the well, first the, one, uh, but uh, I uh, don't uh, know uh, the uh, second uh, one. It's no guessing halves. You, you keep the half to yourself unless other people are stumped for a while. <laughs> But I will, I, I will give have... hints. One's live action, the other is not. Live yep. action? Alright, where is Batsy? Batsy's in the other room. Hey, Batsy! Are you gonna join the stream? 
Are you gonna join the game night stream? Um, every time I do, it kind of destroys the stream. Like, I, it starts, mine starts going to a glacial drip when I'm watching it. Every time he does, it ruins the internet. <laughs> <laughs> so, no. Uh, <laughs> That's okay though. We've got enough people to make this fun. So, sh so I know, right? I need, I need another. I need game. another hit. I think my team. I know the first. Okay, part, you you know the first part. The second part has a Kev is a Kevin Smith movie. Time to Google Kevin Smith movies because no I've got nothing, and I don't no know who Googling. the actor is. And Kevin oh, Smith is not an actor, he's a director. My god, I feel old. I don't know God, that. I feel old now. But you don't know who Kevin Smith is. God, I feel old. And I'm not even 30 yet! Well, it also doesn't help that I, mean, I don't... It also doesn't help that I don't really give a fig about the credits, like who's in what movies. Besides, I have to Google this because I honestly no just don't have any idea. If, I'm Googling You it. Google, you forfeit your answer. <laughs> Wait, this is a nope, three this part, is two. right? This is a yes, two it part. Is. When a baby is born with a wolf and a purr, the abomination with no tails and two heads has to stop the end of existence from happening when God is lost after a trip to play skee ball in New Jersey. I don't... Maybe I'm just not looking at the right one, but I'm questioning how that cooperates. So I did have to Google it. I'm forfeiting my uh, answer here for, for knowing the answer because uh, this annoyed uh, the hell out of me. But... Oh, there's the second part. Okay, I read <laughs> the plot. Well, you can't answer! See, nobody's... No, nobody's going to get this yes, unless they've they seen the movie, because that is yes, such an out-of-the-way well, thing. Oh, Everybody has seen at least part of this movie, even if they don't know it. I uh, have Fine, does everyone else give in? <laughs> yeah, I've never heard of that movie. I haven't, heard, I haven't been able to answer any of these yet. Poor guys. All right, here comes the answer in three, two, one. It's Cat Dogma. Dogma. Heard a cat dog. Dogma, dogma, the Kevin Smith movie where, you know, the lady has to go through Catholicism and, like, save the world because God is missing. Uh, I think you're the only one that has uh, ever heard of that movie. I feel so old. It was, it was in the mid-90s, too. Anyway. Uh, uh, fine. Next one. Here we go. The, it was right above it. So this one, it should be easy, easier to get, probably. In the early 90s, it's the morning hour. Let's watch the show about avoiding shoebies, being radical, and kung fu fighting monsters who then grow and we need to fight them with giant robots. This is two things. I think I can guess the second one. I can't think of the first one. Avoiding. Yeah. Uh. It's the early 90s, and it's the morning hour. Let's watch the show about avoiding shoebies, being radical, and kung fu fighting monsters who then grow big, and we need to fight them with giant interlocking robots. Still can't get the first one. <laughs> morning hour, so it's a Saturday morning cartoon, uh -huh. I assume. Avoiding shoebies, being radical. Shina, PM me what the first one is. I'll PM you the second one. <laughs> <laughs> I think you can PM, right? Oh, you can't because this is freaking 
first stream. You can do it on Picardo. Well, you you can PM each other in Discord or Telegram, you know, outside of the chat. And then it's whoever answers first, yes. right? Cooperative, Cooperative answer. answer. That works. <laughs> I'll give hints. One was Nickelodeon, the other was not. One was a cartoon, the other one was not. Nickelodeon. Nickelodeon. Oh, I didn't. I don't watch Nickelodeon uh. at all. Uh. Okay, Shina, do you? Are you even in the Discord? I don't think Shina's even in the Discord. Wait. Yeah, Shina, I know the second one. I just don't know the first one. We have to work together on this one. Shaohong, uh, what was it called? Zion. Fuck. Shaohong Zine or something like that. Wait, wait, see, okay, so. We are totally cheating in collaboration. They are, but here. at this point, you know what? It, it, oh, okay. Okay. oh we you do? It. China and I have put together yes. the answer. China came up with the first one of Rocket Power, and I came up with the second one of Power so Rangers. So it's Rocket Power Rangers. Collaborative effort. Yes, Woo! indeed. <laughs> Rocket Power. Uh, it was it was one of the more it was one of Never the more obscure of Nicktoons. <laughs> it was about a group of California like dude kids that like <laughs> oh. that were into skateboarding and surfing and lived on the beach, and it was just so so nineties. It was great. All right, here. Let's see. Uh, what do we got here? What's next? Oh, here we go. Here's a funny one. Okay, Let's kill that. The aliens arrive, blow things up, and then we switch to see what's happening today in the family before cutting to an hourglass to signify a commercial break. Well, wow, that first part is completely generic. <laughs> Well, if it was any more specific, it would be really, really obvious. And if you make it the way it is now, it's completely impossible. <laughs> the only thing you need for this, you have to get the second one before the first one even works. Because, come on, every alien movie has explosions. Nuh-uh, not true. <laughs> not all of them. Okay, every alien movie <laughs> nowadays. <laughs> all right, all right, all right fine. Here, home? let me make it a bit... Let me, let me make it more it. obvious for you then. <laughs> the aliens arrive, blow up the White House, and then we switch to see what's happening today in the family before cutting to an hourglass to signify a commercial break. Uh, I don't know kids' shows. This is not a kids' show. Oh, well, I don't... Uh. It, it, it's actu actually one of the clues that I can give you is that this is the longest-running live-action sitcom on television. An hourglass, yep. I don't know sitcoms. <laughs> Neither do I, but my mom watched this all oh. the time when I was a kid, and so I just know that it cuts to an hourglass to signify a commercial break. It's like the... Iron, that's the problem. <laughs> when you were a kid... I'm not even 30 yet! My god, you... <laughs> and this show has been on literally since the 80s, and into today, it's still running. And it's still... Not everybody wants I what you want. <laughs> <laughs> Iron is officially. I'm officially what? <laughs> oh, be careful! He might I just eat you. might. Oh my god, no! He's <laughs> not even. His mouth ain't big enough to eat me. I'm just full of it. All right, you know, on, th on this one you can Google, but you can only Google Hourglass. Hourglass, Hourglass gonna sitcom, help you know. Perfect. There you go. And if you don't get it from that, I will be disappointed. 
hourglass said, come. Ah, uh, this is not. <laughs> I'm just gonna start looking through my Steam games to see if I have anything that can oh. tie well. Oh, well, the only thing that popped up for me is hunted. What? I got a hunted. Mm, nope. When I punch into Google sitcom with an hourglass, it's one of the first couple oh, results. Sand glass? Or whatever? I don't know. Give me random shit. Oh my god, you people are hopeless. I'm not you! Fuck Jay! Okay, I, I think I have another matchup, but it's, uh, I don't know how to tell Yeah, there is a TV show called Hourglass. This is not it. Huh? China? China? Oh, yeah, I, I know it is What now. is it? China just gave it to me. It's Independence there Days it of Our is. Lives. Independence Days of Our Lives. Correct. Thanks, uh -huh. China, for si for giving me yeah, the I know, second like part. <laughs> I said it before I read it, I think, so. <laughs> Days of Our Lives, you can Wikipedia that. It's the longest-running sitcom in history, and it's... Can I vote for another game? What? <laughs> <laughs> He's losing all of them. Come on! Ugh! Here, let me see. Let me do. Let me do this. The easiest one that I can find on the list, just for you. And if you and if well, you don't you get, get it, if you don't get it, we will switch <laughs> to another game. All right. Let's see. What's the? Let me see here. And watch the one help me just to get it. Um, I have a question yeah. about this. Like, I'm not sure if one that I'm thinking of would work. I'm going to send it to you privately over Discord okay. and ask if it works. Anytime, let me see here. I haven't even gotten to the trolley ones yet. That's the thing. <laughs> On the list, I got, I got a couple oh, ones that do work, but they really really are nice and well no that's the thing is they're not a stretch at all but you need to think in a completely different way in order to do it okay this is pro this is probably yeah. the easiest one that i have and i might make it a little bit easier for you so the the creepy and kooky one. go on a game show against another group of folks to figure out what the most popular answers are hmm they're creepy and they're kooky, and they're going on a show against another group of people to figure out what the most popular answers are. Oh, God damn it! We asked 100 people the answer to this question. Okay, would you guys please stop posting it in the Discord? <laughs> like, if you don't know both of them, posting it in the Discord makes it too easy. <laughs> Beastmaster. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. <sighs> don't How could you... Okay, I'm going to give you a hint here. Drew Carey acted in this. Or not acted, but... In what? Oh, Wait, was Drew Carey in that? I think so. I think you're wrong. I could swear Drew Carey uh, was the host of this show. Not the host of this game show. Hang on. No, Drew, Drew Carey took over for Bob Barker on The Price is Right. This, uh, really? I can swear he did this too. Not that I remember. Okay, well, which part are you stuck on? Ah, uh, right. Good point. Wh which part are you stuck on? This is two things. One of them's a TV show and movie. The other one... Aw, oh, Shiner gave it away! The Addams Family Feud. I, I, know just, I actually feud, but I don't know what... The Addams Family. Adam's Family. The Addams Family! 
Yeah. I've never. More, I've it, heard it, of it, but I've never. You, dude, my, that's it, old. It, it's old, but that's old. you say creepy and kooky, and everyone knows that's the Adams Family. Everyone. You don't have to have it. watched it. I could have said Cousin It, you would have got it. Thing, you know, L Lester. <laughs> China's whistling the tune now. <laughs> yes. The creepy and the kooky, the Adam's family. My God. Now the question is, the question is, do you remember the first part of the song? Because that's the last Oh, God, part no, of the I don't song. remember the first part of the song. Oh, except for the doo-doo-doo-doo. My God! It's sad. At least I got half of it finally. You you need to become <laughs> pop cultured, sir. You need to become more versed in pop culture. <laughs> All right, let me. I have a. I think. I think I've got one for movies, but I'm not sure if that would well, work. Well, let either. me let me have some of my fun and do one of the troll ones first. <laughs> oh god. We're gonna no, you're not. No, they're fine. It's not that bad. Uh let me see here. Here it is. Okay. This one this one was the most fun one I ever came up with. And post catch them all, then spend your time being obsessive compulsive about keeping them organized while you work as a detective. Hey, question. Why don't you do a comma? I I, I sometimes I, I actually do do a comma. To separate yeah. the titles? Catch them all. You know which one Catch them all, which? comma. Which then spend post? your time being obsessive compulsive about keeping them organized while you work as a detective. There is a comma in there. Catch them yeah. all on Pokemon, of course. Well, yeah, that's yeah. obvious. That's pretty obvious. And who's everyone's favorite obsessive compulsive detective? Uh, detective, detective. It was a USA series. Pokemon Hall. Pokemon what? Oh, <laughs> Sherlock. <laughs> no, I can't uh, see it. No, it's a US based yes, series. Yes, it is. Pokemon shown on the uh, USA Network, which oh, which is now known as the CW. Oh, the CW. Oh, the painful one. That's like, uh, why? <laughs> uh, I don't watch. Is it currently airing? Uh, or I'm not sure it? if it's currently airing or not. I know it. It wasn't that long ago that it came on. It was you like mid two thousands. Okay, so the TV series went from 2002 to 2009. China! Uh, China's gotten it once again. It's Pokemon. What <laughs> okay, <laughs> last time I checked, Monk was not a CW59 series. Well, it, it, it was on it was on from 2002 to 2009, which 2009 was before the USA network changed into the CW. Oh right! Oh, I oh, I've heard of that series too. That annoys the hell out of me. <laughs> Shine is kicking ass so far, but I love I just I love, almost every one of them I, I love the way this one fits together though. Poke Monk, you just stick an end, a K on the end of Pokemon, and it works. <laughs> All right, we haven't done any three way ones yet. So let's do, let's do oh it. Oh God! Iron Cut wants to do it yep. anyway. Is it really that surprising? You all follow me on FA. Yes. <laughs> oh right. Take a journey to a fantastic place full of insane folks that ends up being just a dream, where you go on adventures with a group of dinosaur kids who duck behind cover and shoot the bad guys in the arcade. This is three separate things. No, this is not a troll. This I'm not trolling you. These three all fit together. Take the journey. 
take a journey to a fantastic place full of insane drug addicted folks that ends up being just a dream where you go on adventures with a group of dinosaur kids who duck behind cover and shoot the bad guys in the arcade. That sounds hilarious. For like, I know a, a lot of these would make awesome freaking movies. <laughs> It made cringy, cheesy movies like Sharknado, but it, it'd fucking be funny. To be fair, I'm surprised nobody used Sharknado. I have Sharknado in here. <laughs> uh, of course you do. <laughs> the problem was, it was tough to come up with something else that ended in shark That because the, I already used the street sharks. So I couldn't do street Sharknado. It had to be something else. Take a journey to a fantastic place full of insane folks that ends up being just a dream, where you go on adventures with a group of dinosaur kids who duck behind cover and shoot the bad guys in the arcade. Do you have any Simpsons ones? I do not have any Simpsons things on here because that would involve either just using Simpsons or just episode titles, which who the hell knows episode titles, except for hardcore Simpsons fans. Right. I'll... By the way, um, Iron, I sent okay. you another good one, but this one, this one's a troll one because it's obscure. Oh uh, yeah, th anyone knows. This yeah, game. that 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 works. That is, uh, I wouldn't know it though. I wouldn't have gotten it. Let me let me give hints on this one though. The first two are animated movies. The third one is an arcade game, yep. and one of the more expensive arcade games too. Duck behind cover and shoot. Wait a minute. Uh. Oh, I know two of them. I don't know the first one. Oh, come on. Uh, take a journey to the to a fantastic place. Something, something what? Uh. I can tell you're close. Oh, I need a hint on the first one. I need one more hint on the first one that I can get Disney the full animated. list. Disney animated. Oh, shit. <laughs> I don't watch Disney movies. <laughs> Those insane folks that ends up being just a dream. Okay, another another hint. Alice, Alice in Wonderland. She's in, in, the protagonist is a woman, and she is in danger of being decapitated at one point. Oh, yes! I know it is. Alice in Wonderland. Do yeah, it! I know, I know it. Alice in, Wonder, Alice in Wonderland Before Time yes! Crisis. Alice in Wonderland Before Time Crisis. I love it. You're welcome. No, here's the thing. I got Time Crisis first because duck behind cover and shoot the bad guys. And then I thought, dinosaurs, wait, Land Before Time Crisis. And I'm like, shit, what is the third one? The only reason I knew Time Crisis is because I played Time Crisis 5 to the end. I was determined. Uh, nicely I done. Game, but I know Alice in Wonderland and uh, The Land Before Time or whatever, but I didn't know the third. But yeah, uh, you're welcome. That was a, that was a <laughs> yeah, nice know, one, right? yes. Let's see, what, what, what else do I have on here? Um, hmm. Okay, this one, this one should... Uh, well, wait, no, that one's actually a bit tough. Actually, you know, I wonder if people can get that now. Now that you guys seem to be a bit more warmed up to this, let's see. I did not just fart. I made a I made a noise with my lips. A small family of two needs to prevent the apocalypse, where zombies overrun the world, and then join with a superhero who knows they're in a movie and constantly tells them that. This is a three-way one. Yes. A small family. Okay, I know the last one. If you know the if you if you know the zombie movie when a small family is involved. What? A family of two, I said. Is this the Walking Dead? Wait, hold up, is there Walking no, Dead? No, no the Walking Dead is not part of this. Damn. Uh, that's what I was thinking, small family. Well, uh, remember this is Okay, so it, a small family needs to prevent the apocalypse where zombies overrun the world and then join with a superhero who knows they're in a movie and constantly tells yep. them so. If you know the last one, you should be able to work backwards through it. Well, zombies overrun the world, and then and, and then which one's when do, when does the 
part and then, yes. right? You can see the commas here and here. But the only problem is the second one is bullshit because a lot of zombie movies start with that word. <laughs> All right, end with that word. George, number three. classic oh, George yeah. Romero zombies. Yeah, I don't know. If that are. and if you get the third movie title, you should be able to get the second one, which leads you to the first. Yeah, I don't know it. Nope. No. I know two of them now. I think I just don't know the first one. A small family of two needs to protect the prevent the apocalypse. Let, let I me need change a hint on that one. Don't let me change the movie. Well, it is, but let me change the wording on that. Uh, a mother and son need to prevent the apocalypse. No idea. Uh, one more hint. Arnold Schwarzenegger. Uh, Oh my god. That was a huge hint, guys. I'm not giving you any more. <laughs> Wouldn't that Wait. be Terminator? <gasps> what? <laughs> Wouldn't that be Terminator? Maybe. That's the only thing I <laughs> okay, um. I know. Okay, uh. Okay, um. Hold on, uh. Lyrics. PM me all the names of Terminator <laughs> movies you remember. I uh, know. I know the other two. You should be able to get it then. I don't remember Terminator oh, movies. Oh come on. He could let me let me put <laughs> it this way. It was early in the Terminator series, so it's one of the good ones. In uh, fact, a lot yeah. of people say this is the it's best Terminator movie. I did watch the movies. I was like, oh my god, I've never heard of the Terminator or Robocop. I ended up watching all of them. Well, well, that wasn't a waste of time. <laughs> I, can, I can imagine uh, a lot more ways that you could have, you know, yeah, that was a good use of your time to watch those movies. What? Yeah, because like they're good. Yeah, come on. What do you got? What do you guys have to get this one? Yeah. I don't remember Terminator movies. And if I do, it's probably. Uh, oh my god. Dina, are you there? You need <laughs> no. Dude, just. Uh, lyrics, just. Damn me all the Terminator movies, and then I can probably I don't get know there. All the titles. Uh, you don't need to know all the titles. You just need to know the title of the best Terminator movies. And I don't know the best, because I've only watched them. I didn't actually into a fan base. I'm not a Terminator fan or either, but I know the title of the... I almost said out loud which one it was. Well, it's <laughs> just, just rub Iron Skelly for the answer. That's all I, I, think oh. I, know. I think I know. Um, Terminator 2, Judgment Day of the Dead. Yes! Pool? Terminator 2, Judgment <laughs> Day of the Dead Pool. Thank you for getting that. My god, I was beginning to lose face. Deadpool? Deadpool. Day of the Dead, Terminator 2, Judgment Day. The best Terminator, the best superhero movie, and the best zombie movie. Deadpool is a superhero whose main thing is regeneration and the yeah. fact that he knows he's in yep. whatever he's in. <laughs> I didn't know I didn't know about Deadpool knowing he's in a movie. When I watched the movie, it didn't seem like he knew. He constantly breaks yeah, the fourth on. wall. <laughs> I know about that in Death Battle, though. Well, <laughs> oh, Dios mio. How did you not what? know he breaks the fourth wall in the damn movie? He, we, the uh, whole point of the intro scene is joking to the main, to the people watching. I'm sorry, it's been a while. It came I mean, out at two point, years I'm ago. Sure he winks at the camera. Oh, my God. Ah, <laughs> oh, should be ashamed of yourself. Yeah. Yeah. What? Are you loving me? <laughs> I still vote. All right, let's do three more of these, and then we'll call it for media matchup. Okay. Oh God. This one's one of my favorites because of what they are and how they fit together. This is a this is a three fur. There are three in this. The purple clad superhero animal of the night who happens to be rich enough to swim in his money vault with his three grandnephews, has to pilot airplanes to ship cargo. 
Now those words reminded me of Richie. Rich. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I know the second one. Well, I know that I know vaguely what the second one is. I don't know if I've got the name right because I never saw it. Well, uh, I'll give a massive hint in that one of them is getting a big reboot. Oh, I know. I know the first two. There now. you go. And I'm still lost, so. Wait, hang on. I'm going to go back to my second. <laughs> Where the hell is this person? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Well, Shina's got it again. Of course, Shina <laughs> has it. The question is, can anyone else get it before Shina posts? Probably not. <laughs> you guys give up too easily. I'm sorry. If you got, if you got two, you should be able to get to the third one. Because it's in the same... Oh, I know, oh. I know it, I know it. Hurry up! Yeah, Darkwing DuckTail Spin. Darkwing DuckTail Spin. Combination of three Saturday morning Disney animated movies, often shown back-to-back -back on Disney afternoons. Darkwing Duck, DuckTales, oh, and, and Tailspin. Here's, here's the worst thing about this. I have never seen... Either any of those. Neither three. have I. <laughs> but they fit together so nicely. <laughs> I, I call bullshit on me knowing that and you making. It. <laughs> I just my my when I first figured this that this one fits together, I was like, you cannot be serious. These three shows, which are basically the same, shown back to back on the Disney Channel. They're all Disney. They're all Disney animated cartoons, and they fit. How did this happen? But yes, Darkwing Duck Tail Spin. By far one of my favorite media mashups I've ever made. All right, let's do let's do one more troll one, because I like because I like the hell out of this one. <laughs> and paste and paste a group of escaped zoo animals get trapped in an African country where they have to win the piston cup that just reminded me of cars <laughs> Uh, I know it. Is. I know it. Madagascar's. Madagascar's. Yes, I made that one a bit too easy. That was painfully easy. That was painfully easy. Yeah, I shouldn't have said pissing if cup. If I would have read that, I would have been able to get it. But I didn't read it. I just heard it on the second part. I didn't read it either. I knew it. I like I like the hell out of this one because this is another one where you just stick S on the end of Madagascar and it works. <laughs> I made it way too easy by saying the piston cup though. If I'd left if I'd have left it yeah, as they have to win the championship car race, you guys would have been lost forever on this one. Uh, I would have I wouldn't have been. I would have got I, it. I bet you money you okay. wouldn't have. <laughs> wow. Then you're betting the wrong person. Okay, I have a I have a I just sent you another one that I actually would like to try All before right. we leave. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead and do it. Okay, so I'm going to copy this from the thing I just posted here. Oh, I have to... I forgot I refreshed, so I have to pick uh, my again. It's copying the background color, too. Ugh, Jesus. Uh, well, we <laughs> okay. A rapidly moving hedgehog has to race against the orange sun and blue moon before the storm comes. Uh, so Sonic the Hedgehog? Uh, Okay, it's a specific it's game, though. You can cut Sonic the Hedgehog out because every freaking... Actually, it's not Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> well, ah. it, is, it is Sonic, but the name does not have the Hedgehog in it. Shadow. Here's a hint. They were both Game Boy games. Game Boy Advance, actually, uh -oh. to be specific. 
So is it Shadow? No, wait. Uh, Shadow the Hedgehog was not on the Game Boy Advance. <laughs> I don't remember many games. He, he's making it pretty either. easy by telling you that it was on the Game Boy Advance and that it was a Sonic series. It's yeah, pretty. It's pretty easy to get the title old. of what Sonic game it is from that. You're talking to an 80 year old who had a GameCube, not a Game Boy Advance. What? What was uh, ever? Rip. You had no What was childhood. every game that was ever poured into the Game Boy Advance called? <laughs> Shut up! It's too easy a hint. You basically already gave him that hint by telling them it was a Game Boy Advance game. <laughs> yeah, but it wasn't that obvious. To anybody who's ever who existed in the era of Game Boy Advance, it was. <laughs> well, he didn't have a Game Boy Advance, and I haven't seen it in the I chat, so. But I only played a uh, what's that Game Boy game again? Uh, what's Tony Hawk not? or something. No, it's not. I was gonna say it's not Tony Hawk. It was. Uh, That's that the only skateboarding old, that franchise old I know. Where these uh, dudes go surfing and skating and everything. <laughs> We're getting off topic here. <laughs> We can go off topic as much as I because this game is mind fucking me to the end. <laughs> me a mashup for you. Does anyone have any ideas? How about you solve your own? <laughs> oh, I already made this. Of course I know the answer. <laughs> solve it then, Mr. Hotshot. Does nobody else have any ideas? Nope. Iron Gut, do well, you have I, one? I th oh, well, I can't say that because <laughs> yeah, I did. told you the answer. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I had to make sure this would no, work. No, it okay, doesn't. Okay, so I'm not seeing no, anyone it, else No, it doesn't have it, anything so. to do with Pokemon Sun and Moon. No. Nor does it have anything to do with Bill nope. Nye. <laughs> Bill, not a science guy. Bill, Bill, Bill. Well, that was a hard derailment. <laughs> uh, China, do you have anything? You're usually the one that can get these. No idea. Wow. <sighs> okay. Sonic Advance Wars. So Sonic Advance. Sonic what? Advance Wars. Combination of Sonic Advance and Advance Wars. Yeah, I've never heard of Sonic Advance before in the Sonic Every, what? <laughs> Every kid who ever owned a Game Boy had Sonic Advance. I have a feeling I was gonna like smack me. I just might. <laughs> the sad thing is, I didn't think. Like, I thought it was going to be, you know, Advance Wars that trip people up. Even I, I can't believe I was people couldn't really get specific. Sonic Advance. It's like, literally, like, every major franchise that came out for the it. Game Boy Advance had Advance in the title. Mar Super Mario Brothers Advance, <laughs> really Sonic did. Advance, Advance Wars, Dodgeball Advance, 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 Advance. Pretty much every game that came out for the Game Boy Advance was... It had it yes. somewhere in the title. It was pretty bad. Oh, just like everything for the Nintendo 64 and 64 in the title. I just came up with another idea for a media mashup. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's pretty easy oh, to get, though, now. <laughs> Fudge. Well, tell you what. <laughs> this will be the last one, and this is another three fur. So, eh. Another three, another three title one. So after this, we'll switch to some other game. Uh, oop, come on, Firefox, don't crash on me. Thank you. So, after you are <laughs> turned into a wolf, you must stop the voodoo man who has turned another one into a reptile. And to do that, you need to cross the busy highway. Do you think I know any of these? Y yes. Oh, I know it. I know it immediately. What is it? Uh, let's, let's give him another. Yeah, let's give, give him a chance uh, to get it too. No, 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 no. no. Yes, I'm not, it's gonna take me about thirty minutes to realize. Nobody else gets to answer this one un unless he gives up, and then it's me. And you're not allowed to give up immediately. <laughs> okay, so after you are turned into a wolf, is that a cartoon? That is anime, a game. Or 
Game, game movie, game. That's yep. your hint. Alright. Okay. Uh, I really want to give him this hint, but I have a feeling if I give it to him, it's going to give him the, the third one well, entirely. Well, send it to me in Discord. I don't know many games because I'm not a PC gamer. Neither of neither of the games in this are PC games. Is it on a uh, old game system, or new game system? One is. R <laughs> I just I just sent you my hint. Oh my god! Oh my god! Look. Ugh. Yeah, you could you could say Where? that. <laughs> okay. The hint for the last one is you might have blown a lot of quarters on this. It's it's oh, no. a it's a retro game. The last one is a retro game. The other one is a more modern game. Yeah, I don't play many retro retro <sighs> games, so should I just say No it? Yes. You are not allowed to give up <laughs> But Oh, I don't want to say what I was about to say because it's totally insulting. Titles, I'd probably guess the whole thing. Like, let me let me help two. you out a bit. Then, the middle movie should help you a lot, and that one is a Disney animated movie. In fact, it is the last Disney animated movie. If I remember correctly, it also had a character die horribly. Oh yes, it did. It was one of the few it's Disney movies that actually killed the character. I've never heard character. of a Disney movie where the dude turns into a reptile. Okay, what Disney movies do you know where the where a character has died horribly and where someone is turned into a reptile? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I actually don't yes, know. Yes, you any. do. Oh my god, uh, you don't know any Disney movies where someone is turned into a reptile. Oh, you are farting. the worst brain farter ever. <laughs> There's at least three the movies room. from Disney where a guy gets turned into a reptile of some sort. You can't think of one of them? I'm starting to think somebody at Disney... I think Disney... Someone at Disney has a I know, fetish it for that must kind of be. thing. <laughs> okay. I'm just going to say it now. He's a moron. Let me let me get the right, let me right, the right answer. Right, what's the right answer? <laughs> Uh, Legend of Zelda, Twilight Princess, and the Frogger. There you go. It's the Legend of Zelda, Twilight Princess, and the Frog. Er, <laughs> combination of Frogger, which you know of, Princess and the Frog, which is not that old, and Legend of Zelda, Twilight Princess, the second best Zelda game. Wait a second, Frog is not a freaking reptile. Okay, amphibian. Oh, but if I'd have said frog in the clue, you would have gotten it off the bat. <laughs> I have to. Why? Is that I was thinking actually reptiles. I wasn't thinking freaking amphibians. Yeah, that wasn't fair because I didn't think frog from reptile either. <laughs> what? Okay, Beast Fury. <sighs> How can you not? No. Wait, Frogger is, isn't that the game where you have to hop, hop, you hop, hop across, across traffic. traffic? Yes. It's hop across yes. traffic the I game. I said you're going to blow a lot of quarters on it. I, I've never had to blow that many quarters. Never fail. Wow. <sighs> it's easy to get across traffic. Oh, jeez. Easy. I can play Frogger in real life, but I don't think I'd actually play. Oh, Jesus. Has anyone ever played Frogger in real life? I, I have. Know a few friends back then and back and forth, I would. <laughs> oh, wow. There's kids nowadays that do it just for fun. And the cars just go like. I think that'll be enough for media mashup then if people are stuck. No, I have, I have, uh, well, first of all, um, China oh, right, wants yeah, to do one. Yeah, go ahead. But. I have a good joke. A I joke? Have a joke. What? Yes. What does a German? What does a German shark say on a good day? Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna eat you out. I don't know. 
What does a German exactly what, what does a German shark say on a good day? Nein. Iron Gluton Dog. Oh god. <laughs> you deserve a slap or at least a bop for that, but I'm on the other side of real life. <laughs> I thought it was clever. <laughs> and yes, Shina got yes, it. Yes, she did, damn it. <laughs> what now what is your media match of uh, China? <laughs> I have to get one bad pun out of the way, like, every day, otherwise I explode. Okay. A meteor shower observed out of a telescope that is actually a crash-landing alien spaceship had been lost in space with a bunch of kids on board, a teacher, commander, and a female cyborg in tune with the ship itself. Uh... Wow, that one's... I know, I know what one mm. of the things is... I'm just not sure whether it's the second thing or the first thing. Yeah, where, what order is that in? Jeez. A meteor shower observed out of the telescope that is... I, okay, the, what I have is the second one. A meteor shower observed out of a telescope that is actually a crash landing alien spaceship. Uh, the I don't see it in the, uh, the oh, there it is. That one is meteor shower observed... Uh, where is it? I don't see it written. Uh, la, 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 la. Is it in the chat? Oh, yes. Sorry. Yeah, it's oh, in the chat. Is. I didn't copy paste it yet. Hang on. Copy. Major shower observed out of a telescope that is lost in space. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. I, I've got order. it then. I've got it then. I'm going to I'm gonna give everyone else a chance to get it, but I've got it. If if what if that is if what you just said is correct, then I've got it. Because <laughs> I got the second one. The second one is the challenge to get because it is. I'm not gonna say it's obscure, but it was a uh, a kids show that wasn't the it uh it wasn't. It, I don't know how to describe it. Iron to get all the shitty kids. <laughs> well, it, yeah, it was good, but it wasn't like one of the ones that is a tentpole show. So it kind of got lost in history. Yeah, it was a ripoff of Star Trek Voyager, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think Iron might be the only one that gets this because I'm blanking entirely. Ah. Yeah, I don't think anyone else is going to know the second thing. <laughs> Lyrics, do you know anything? Oh, I didn't even I didn't even try. You're not so even trying to oh, for fuck's wow. sake. Hey, we're putting this on YouTube. Hi, my fuck language. Fuck YouTube. <laughs> wow. YouTube doesn't give a two shit. They, they did at first and then they fucking stopped. How many times does Markiplier curse in each episode? A hundred times yeah. a day? A hundred times a video. <laughs> <laughs> a bunch well, of kids anyways, board, let me... Okay, I'm I will, I I will, I will tell my guess for the answer, which I'm pretty sure is correct. Lost in space cases. Combination of lost in space and space cases... Which was exactly as Shida described. It's a show about a bunch of kids lost on a spit. Oh! Oh! Oh, oh shit! Oh! Okay, so I got the first part wrong, but I know Space Cases is correct title for the second one, which is a Nickelodeon show. Where... It a meteor shower <laughs> observed out of a telescope that is actually a crash-landing alien spaceship has been staged for Okay, so mm. oh. something space yes, cases. Yes, something space cases. There are space cases. Dun, dun. China, we need hints. 
You can't just. Yeah, I can't. I can't think of anything because there's too many commas in that. <laughs> well, uh, I, let me let me tell what? you which part of her clue is space cases. Oh, the it's an old the movie. spaceship of it lost is. in space with a bunch of kids on board, with their teacher, the commander, and the cyborg who is uh connected to the ship itself. That's space cases. I'm thinking Star Wars. It's not no, Star Wars. It's never Star Wars in this game. <sighs> That's the only thing I know where it's oh. Cyborg robot. A mere sh- oh, I have one that actually could work for Star Wars, though. <laughs> <laughs> uh, old movie in space. Oh, man. And it's not lost in space cases. What would, a meteor shower observed out of a telescope that is actually a crash landing alien spaceship. Oh. It's an old movie. It's not E.T. Um. Oh. We need another hint. I yeah. Um. Hmm. Well, she's Shana said old with emphasis on the O's, so I'm guessing something black and white. Oh God! At least, uh, yeah. yeah that, <laughs> that's that's what yeah, I think on. when I think old. It's a black and white. Are you kidding me? Huh. I don't oh, know any oh, black and white movies. Is it Journey to Space Cases? If that's right, then I'm going to make a joke nope, about I'm how you are. No, I'm wrong again. Oh, it's good. good it's not. Black uh, and white. I, and I'm wrong anyways space. on that. I'm thinking Journey to the Moon, the uh, the one where the Jules Verne came up with it. The guys are shot out of a cannon to the moon. and Yeah, that's... Uh, that's... Uh, uh, a voyage de la luna, a, aka a trip China, to the moon. That's not helpful. I don't know your birthday. <laughs> uh, yeah, we don't know your birthday, China. We don't know. <laughs> Gosh dang it! I just thought of an. I just thought of a good one that would work for this. But I know it's not because the one I'm thinking of is actually a game. It's an old game too. Hmm. Oh, that's good. Oh, God. And just looking up black and white space movies on Google comes up with so many things from, like, that era that end in the word space. Like, it came from space. Killers from space. Phantom from space. (laughs) I think I know which one it is, though. Is it Plan 9 from Outer Space Cases? So many space movies. No, it's not Plan Nine from Outer Space Cases. Wow. Okay. Oh man, I have. N- it could be any of these. Teenagers from <laughs> yeah, Outer Space really Cases. I married a monster from Outer Space Cases. Uh, Queen of Outer Space Cases. Uh, first man into space cases. <laughs> Which? <laughs> what? What China, is this? This isn't cool. China, Enemy from us. space cases. Cool. Fire and maidens of outer space cases. <laughs> Assignment outer space cases. China, just give us it the came fucking... from outer space cases. That's what it is. Oh my god. Uh, no. China, I'm starting to think you're the old one here. If you that one. Oh my god. <laughs> You are banned <laughs> from this game. You are not allowed to use black and white movies. Oh god, damn it! I never knew. I never realized how many of those old timey black and white sci fi movies ended in the word space. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that was like the only thing they ended in in like that I period know. of time. <laughs> Okay, I think that's the end of Media Mashup. That one I think right there. So. Fuck. Uh, <laughs> oh, God. This is just well. Sorry, 
don't want the media mashup. Oh god. <laughs> oh. Jesus. I mean, I didn't. I thought That's space cool. cases would be the hard part. <laughs> and then, then China said black and white. And it's like, uh oh. <laughs> Oh god. I I want to I want to play an episode of Space Cases now if I've got one on my hard drive. Let me see if I've got one. Uh or oh I know. I I can just go to YouTube and play like the uh promo for Space Cases. Hang on a second. Like a, the intro alone is just magic. Space Remember it's Space magic, Space Cases magic. intro. Here we go. Oh, come on, ad. This summer, get three ad block pro is your friend. Sun that show it's so cheap and cheesy and awful but it's so awesome all right before we lose beast what i next? do not know 